Sure. Um, first of all, I'd encourage them to do it. Uh, it builds courage doing that, and it builds your confidence. Uh, I would also suggest that the first few times that you do it, that you specifically plant somebody in the audience who will give you a critique afterwards, mm -hmm. and also plant somebody in the audience who will ask you a question, mm -hmm. because sometimes it's hard to get the room started. Mm -hmm. You need to be comfortable redirecting questioners. Uh, oftentimes, too often, people will grab the mic and they'll give a speech instead of a question. and. Mm -hmm. um, you, you, if the moderator is not going to do it, you need to kind of regain control for the sake of the rest of the audience, not mm -hmm. for you. Mm -hmm. um, so I'd encourage you to do it. And if you don't know, if you're not confident in your answer, my advice is that you say, um, I know I read that report, but I'm just not feeling sharp enough to answer that question. Mm -hmm. Can I get the answer back through your president mm -hmm. for your next meeting? Mm -hmm. Or I will email that to you. But don't, if you truly don't know an answer, don't make one up. And there's 101 ways that you can rehearse ahead of time how you're going to respond to a question that you don't know the answer to. So have that in your hip pocket and practice how you're going to say I don't know in a way that is comfortable for you.